Hi, this is a message for United Water. This is a customer in Bergen County, New Jersey. Well, the reason why I'm making this video is because we got a notice, like right there, that they wanted to replace the meter, the water meter. And, you know, I know about the whole smart meter uh, debate, and um, I found out that it was going to be a smart meter. So I called up and complained. And to my horror, I found out that I have an analog meter down there, but there's this box attached that's a broadcaster that broadcasts just like a smart meter. And as you can see, when it pops, the one means it's out of range for this HF35C analyzer, which I bought just for this box here. Spent over 400 bucks on it, but now I know. So, every time it pops and it says 1, that's reading over 2,000 milliwatts per square foot. Which is the same readings I get standing across the street from a cell tower. So, anyway, I also have an, um, a tri fuel meter back there, which I don't know if it's coming in. It's not very accurate for taking measurements, but as you can see, it'll, it'll also pop at the same time that this other meter pops. And... My question is, United Water claims that they only read, take readings once a month, and they're going to be going to once every three months. And my complaint is, why is this thing broadcasting constantly, putting RF into our house, when RF has been classified as a carcinogen, according to the World Health Organization? There's numerous problems with RF. People get sick, there's headaches. Nausea, reproductive problems, sleep problems, buzzing in the ears. I mean, the list goes on and on. People are sensitive to this stuff. And just because you aren't doesn't mean it's not affecting you. The body's electric and these fields are not good for the body. So, by the way, this meter is a Neptune R900. And... I asked my mother about this because she was the one who let them in to install it and they told her it was so the readings could be taken over the phone. Now, they meant that it would wirelessly transfer to telephone poles, but, you know, my mother thought it was the regular phone. I did see it and I just thought it was part of the phone system because here's our really old phone system and then... Verizon just switched us over against our will to Fios. We wanted to keep the copper, but no choice in the matter. And so far I've talked with United Water and I've expressed my complaints, not so much about the smart meter, because that's not actually going to broadcast, but about this broadcaster that they don't tell you what this is and people don't know what it is. And I'm at least aware enough to know, but it's really just not fair that people could be getting sick and not even know what this thing is. And it's ridiculous how much this is broadcasting when they only need a reading once a month. I mean, why can't it just broadcast once a month or once a week? It's, it's insane. So this is for you, United Water. I don't want this thing broadcasting so much.